Do it my best to make it last.
thank you for coming in. Thank you for having us. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Thank you very much. Totally, totally. So, um, new album is called Cosmic Americans. What is a Cosmic American? That's a good question. Yeah. Um, so we, when we, had, we had, when we were finishing up our first record, I um, was kind of looking around, uh, you know, different kind of things uh, that I'd never listened to before, just looking for kind of what I thought we were gonna you know, go become. And um, I had came across the Flying Burrito Brothers and I'd like heard a little bit of Graham Parsons before and, and I'd actually heard a little bit of Flying Burrito, uh, Flying Burrito Brothers before, um, but I it was their first record. I think it was a song called Christine's Tune. And I was just like, wow, what is this? And I started like reading up on Graham and, and getting really interested in his life. And, um, you know, he was a really big influence to a lot of, you know, really successful people when he was alive. Uh, you know, like the Rolling Stones, uh, a really big influence on the Rolling Stones. And he kind of had this idea of like combining, um, you know, like rock and roll music and country music and like soul and R&B and just all these different sounds together. And, um, you know, he really kind of became the guy that a lot of people say sort of like came up with like what we call like Americana music, really, uh, like the godfather of Americana music. And it was kind of funny because we were definitely like, you know, like an Americana band or whatever. Um, but like I hadn't really like gotten too much into him or his music or his sound or whatever. And and then I just read that, yeah, that's what he called that concoction of noises. He called it cosmic American music. And I was like, whoa, <laughs> that, that like really, really struck a chord because um, something about like something about uh, like the American part of it, I really liked. And, and, and I mean, the cosmic part too, uh, you know, like just letting a little bit more cosmic, I think, this into what we, you know, cosmicness into what we do. But um, like, I don't know, something about that just phrased together, like was really, really, like it really struck a chord with me. And then, um, yeah, I mean, then it just was like from there on, it was just like, this is what we're, it just shot off from there. Uh, and so it was like, we, I, I thought of like the name uh, of the record at first, I guess, really. And then it was like, oh, that's a cool idea. Like, let's maybe really, really like, you know, like bring in more of those sounds that we were already like leaning towards. Like, let's just shine all those through a little bit brighter. And that's, you know, that's what happened. You know, we got cosmic. A little bit. Yeah, a little. <laughs> just enough. <laughs> Totally, totally. Thank you for that. Um, you. I mean, and also, you all hail from Pomeroy and thereabouts, right? Pomeroy, S Ohio? Sort of. That's actually, yeah, we, I, I say that maybe a little too often, and people <laughs> believe it. Now, um, me and Dustin are definitely from Meigs County, from Pomeroy. Pomeranians. Pomeranians. Um, Bobby, uh, Bobby is originally from Columbus. Um, where are you from, Bobby? I'm from the bottoms, west side. Uh, <laughs> but we all went to we all went to high school together. So Bobby lived in Pomeroy for a long time. Uh, where, where you? I'm from Waterford, Ohio, like North of Marietta, born and raised. Unfortunately, but uh, yeah. <laughs> and I'm a West Virginia cat. I'm from Parkersburg. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, but we all we all met um, kind of you know Mid Ohio Valley area. You know, uh, nice. I was I hosted an open mic at the Adelphia Music Hall in Marietta. Oh, cool. Um, and I think. Chuck, you'd come a couple times before Jake started to come. Um, Which is weird because when I started going, that was actually like four years ago, like like two, a couple days ago, actually. I yeah, I know, I saw. But yeah. I remember like the first time he walked into the thing, you know, he's, it's a new guy. Well, you, you got your little like regulars at these things. And I was like, who's this guy? <laughs> then he got up and started playing. So, like I think you were just getting ready to put out Driving, that record yeah, Driving. Yeah. And he got up and played a couple songs from it. And I was like... It, instead of who's this guy, it was oh who's this guy, and like fast forward, I remember like at some point I just I was never I was a guitar player I played drums because I liked it but and I'd sometimes get up and play on you know with people at that open mic and at some point Jake's like hey man I'm thinking about putting a band together do you want to play drums and I just remember all I could think was like me why why, why would you oh, okay <laughs> you're just one of the best musicians I'd seen so I was like he could probably do that I bet he could do it. Well, yeah, yeah. No, that's that was that night was a big night for me because when I had went to that open mic and and met you and Chuck and I did not know that Chuck had only recently started going because I had thought that you guys had been playing together and knew each other for years and were just like really good friends because of just like the level of talent there was just insane. I also met Maddie there, my fiance. I met her that night as well. Like it was it 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 set all of this into motion. So you're welcome. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Awesome. Well, yeah. thank you all for coming in again. Uh, is there anything else you'd like to say? 
Um, we've got, uh, we'll have uh, vinyl pressings of the record. That's oh, going to cool. be coming out uh, within the next couple of months. Uh, and we'll probably be doing like a nice, cool like re-release show party for that. Because um, nice. we'll, we'll definitely have plenty of those uh, colored vinyl. They'll be, wow. yeah, very cool, very cool. What colors? All colors. All colors. Yeah, I was going to say red, white, and blue would be like, yeah. appropriate. <laughs> like, a, like a grab bag of colors. Yeah. I think. Cool. Yeah, absolutely. Well, cos we're all cosmic Americans, so all colors. <laughs> all colors. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. So, yeah.